Hello Facebook. So um, over here, sat, looking with a beautiful view of the English Channel amid the fog and the darkness, um, to just say hi. And we're going to come along pretty much every Monday around 8 o'clock, very optimistic 8 o'clock, um, just to mess around and say hello. So um, yeah, we're just here to chat about, uh, we've got a new single coming out and we just kind of want to intro it. Just so you know, we have, we have Meredith sat over in the background. She's now listening to me so I can hear myself in stereo. Yeah. Yeah. Brilliant. And it's, what, are, we, are, we, are we on delay? We have a delay going on. I can name myself five minutes on delay. Cheers, everyone. Or oh, sausage to those who know the, you know the meaning. Um, so things are going really well so far with Bamboozle. It's very exciting. We recently filmed a video for our heebie-jeebies um, at Debbie's house, who lives in a church. Um, and apparently we're going to get a sneak preview of this video in the next couple of days, which I'm really excited about. Um, yeah, we had lots of very cool people dressed up as very scary monsters. And except for Dan, Dan was just normal. Um, Meredith's sending me notes and I actually can't. So it's like the school notes. She's, she's holding up notes and I have no idea what that just said. <laughs> Brilliant. The system works great. See, so it's our first video. The system is working brilliant. It's our first one ever. It is. It's our first video <laughs> ever. <laughs> it's very exciting. It's very nerve-wracking as well. I'm a bit scared. Um, because we don't know it's going to look like it. But, um, yeah. But the single's coming out on Halloween, which is my absolute favourite time of year. I love Halloween. It's really exciting. Um, because we get to dress up and be weird and and that not be weird because I probably do that most of the year but heebie jeebies is the title of that single she says I'm getting notes um yeah we did uh the video was in so Debbie lives in this beautiful amazing old church and her garden is a graveyard which is really cool. So the, the um, video was filmed in between the gravestones and there was lots of smoke. And, oh, Jim says hi. <laughs> hi, babe. <laughs> he's not here with us tonight. He's um, skiving. No, seriously. he's. <laughs> and apparently, if I lean back too far, I might fall out of the window. So. Scary. Um, yeah, anyway, so we, we filmed this amazing thing in a graveyard. There was lots of jive dancing. Um, if there's any of you out there who don't know about jive dancing yet, go watch the video, go along to a few classes, because it's very, very cool. And you feel like you're back in the 1950s. Um, and everybody had, we had full monster makeup done by Fizzog Makeup, which was Carrie and Billy, and they were amazing. Um, less than the two of them, uh, along with Sophia, actually helped. Um, so there's three of them doing makeup for about 30 people and two nights running. So they worked ridiculously hard. That was really cool. Um, yeah, we did a two night shoot and I think we finally finished about 2.45 a.m. So without the makeup, you can imagine we'd have all looked like monsters anyway. I would. <laughs> so, <laughs> Susan Anderson. Is she online? That's my She's sister. Online. Susan's online. Hi, Susan. I'm still learning names. It's terrible. We have we have a Susan, and and there's an Esme, right, Kathy? There is. She's sat in the background. Yes. Wait, Esme was one did the walk. Was it Esme's walk? Mm. She was. She did an amazing walk for charity the other week, and it was amazing. All over London. Oh, it's Rex. Hi there. from Kathy's nephew, Rex. Oh, hi, Rex. <laughs> I think we spoke on the phone the other day on Skype. Um. So yeah, so the song's called Heebie Jeebies and the inspiration behind the song, um, it was one of those weird ones. I actually wrote the song over a year ago um, and it was, it was one of those where when, you, when you're at gigs and you're playing, it kind of, you know, you're doing the same song so you get a bit of time to think while you're doing the stuff. And I was sort of stood there thinking um, um, and it was kind of like the whole atmosphere was really awesome at one of these gigs. And it sort of got my mind on this kind of cool 
slightly spooky also atmosphere um thing and i was like what if you had like so if you were on stage you this person um or even if you were just a, a random person in one of these things and you had this guy who was always there he was always like there and you knew he was there and every time he was there he was a little bit he gives you that kind of creepy feeling um but eventually it's kind of like the creepy feeling turns into a kind of nice creepy feeling and you know it's one of those um yeah so it's, it was kind of like uh you know obviously with jim so so, <laughs> so it's, it's a hypothetical situation but uh, you know it's one of those cool situations that you think this would be very nice to be in if i was single yeah um very it was cool you know it, so it's i think a lot of the songs are right um a lot of them are from experience, but a lot of other ones are from, um, I mean, I, I, I don't just write songs, I've written stories, poems, I've written a couple of books, and I love thinking about the what ifs. You know, the what if you're in this situation, what might happen, how would you feel? It's a lot about the feeling. There's a lot of emotions that go into the songs. Um, and this was one of those, it was just like, I had that feeling, I was like, I had that grip on a feeling, and it was, it was very visual. Um, the lyrics very visual you know it's cool so I, like, I like the song which is interesting because usually i go ah, i wrote this song it's terrible i'm gonna hate it but um this time i actually think no it's all right it's not bad i'm not i'm not completely embarrassed by one of my own songs and that's a really nice thing <laughs> um but yeah um i was gonna talk about the band actually the band's going really really well um, and we've had some really funny stuff so this time last year uh, so 2017, I think we might have had two gigs booked for 2018, um, which is quite scary when you're full time. But this year, we're pretty much, we've got a lot of gigs for 2019 already and two in 2020, which is ridiculous. I mean, who plans that far ahead? I can't remember what I'm doing next week. Actually, no, I do know what I'm doing next week. I don't know what I'm doing the week after. Next week, we're up in London. Um, and I'm really excited about next week's gig because we are doing, well, we're doing one in Deal at the Lighthouse, which is one of our traditional venues, which is just a very cool music venue. Um, and it's always got an amazing audience and it's a really fun night. But we're also doing our sort of like debut at uh, the Root Sisters reunion gigs. Uh, I'm really excited about that because um, my lovely friend Aisha Khan runs this with uh, Rosella and the girls are so cool and they're all about um, women in Roots music and it's really cool so I'm really excited to be invited to do um, this gig it's gonna be fun so that's on the 20th next week in London come along check the website um, so the biggest reason we're here the biggest reason is we are going to do a little competition a big competition apparently I'm told um, so the competition is all about launching a new single on Spotify um, and clicking on the pre-save link in the uh, details of this video. So you click the pre-save link and pre-save, which a pre-save basically means that you get, as soon as Hebe Jeebies is available, it will magically appear on your Spotify. 31st of October. Which is on the 31st of October, which is when we're releasing it. Um, so the pre-save link is there, but then when you've pre-saved it, Click the link once more and don't forget to enter your email address because without your email address, we cannot, um, you know, find out who's won because otherwise you're just a random entity, which is, you know, cool. I think something's going to get thrown at me. So, ah, I got it. So we have prizes. So the big prize, one bamboozle hoodie, which is very cool. One bamboozle t-shirt. Ah. And a bag, a lovely bag, and this little tote bag. I go shopping with this, and seriously, I actually go shopping with this. Mm -hmm. Shameless advertising. Keep, Keep going. Throw things. Carry. Ah, it's coming. <laughs> this one subtly came in. This is a seven-inch limited edition single of Mayhem with also Daddy's Girl original track on the inside. <laughs> it's really creepy. It's creepy things weird. Our original EP of Red Right Hand, which we now have only like 10 vinyl left of, but um, this is the CD. So the CD, we've not got that many left of them either, so get them on can. And the Mayhem single. 
And also, well, this is here, we don't have it yet, but the signed Heebie Jeebie single, when that comes out. And that's it. No, it's not it. Oh, There's a badge. There's I a didn't badge. Know the badge She's lost the There's badge. A sticker. And a sticker. 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 The sticker is my And that's the second prize. A sticker. And a tote bag. We've done the bag. Yeah, but the second prize. Oh, the second out. prize. So then, so there's one big prize, which is basically pretty much everything that we sell. Um, but then there are also five runners up prizes of a bag and a CD and stuff. I, I will make more proper Heebie details. CD. Heebie Jeebie CD. Badges. Badges. Stickers. Badges, stickers, stickers <coughs> and, and love. Lots in of love. Nice, in a nice bag. And yes, I very much love love from all of us here at Bamboozle HQ. Um, so that was that's in our competition. It's very exciting. So don't forget to click the link and don't forget to put your email address in as well. Gerald. She just writes me random notes. I have a Bowen. Note in. Gerald. Bowen's online. Gerald Bowen is online. Hi Gerald. This is great. I've got Ian <laughs> is online. It's great. Oh, David Smart's online. Oh, David. Hi, David. He's Adele great. Thornton. And Rex and Esme are still my, my, my cousin Smelly Deli's online. Ian She's going to kill me for that forever. Ian Miller. Ian Miller. Hi, Ian. Hey, everyone. This is awesome. Cuddly toy. <laughs> <laughs> and the next on the... I can't remember what called. Conveyor belt. Conveyor belt. It's a cuddly toy. Okay. We can't do the boat, like, also. Maybe right. if, you know, get out of single to number one. Like, I'm get competition now. Yeah. Click on it. Do it. Do it. I'm going to move up, Curtis. I'm going to have a guest. So, we, like I said, we're going to do this regularly, but this week we have our wonderful Keith Wilkinson. <laughs> Thank you. I'm going to also pick up a guitar. This is a new, this is a new thing for me. Bass guitars. Let's do this. Like this. Ah. Oh. Fretless. He's just trying to test me, that's all. High action, is. hard to play. <laughs> Thanks, Keith, I love you. Yeah. <laughs> so this is Keith. Keith is, um, well, you might know him from Squeeze and the Jar family, but he's also our lovely Meredith Silver Heart. <laughs> <laughs> so very exciting, I'll be here. Um, so Keith's going to play with me tonight. I'm going to do a little rendition of Heebie Jeebies. Without the lovely Jim Nolan. Without our lovely Jim. And without Les. Actually, Jim's here. He's here. He's, he's here. watching. He's, he's here. watching us. He's stalking us. <coughs> I don't know. Les doesn't do Facebook. He gets in trouble. Seriously. <laughs> Seriously. He gets in trouble. He's not allowed to do Facebook. <clears throat> I'm going to move my line. It's, um, we did this in rehearsal and I kept forgetting my lyrics. <laughs> <laughs> it's a beautiful thing of writing your own songs and um, forgetting what the heck. Do you know what? When I forget my lyrics, it's always one of my own songs. Always. Do do Remember it? the rest of them. Anyway, shall we play a song? Yeah, let's do it. Okay. <laughs> I <laughs> want <laughs> to I want to All this pack from front to back got to feel you out this way I'm going through through dust and gloom and a rising Spines of cold ripples through my Presence is a bitter taste. Fever shows down my spine. The boy I need to sign. That's just meant to be my babe. Give me the keys when you look at me. That just makes me cold. Give me the keys when you look at me. Just till my bones are. Give me the keys in my darkest dreams. It's a dangerous game you play. Give me the keys when you look at me. Dangerous, can you? 
competition don't forget the email and um we'll see you next week bye bye from the french <laughs> so that's, that's, that's... Au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir. how can i not remember that <laughs>